everyone. Welcome to the BT Extra, the exclusive online content you'll only find online after the show is done. Now, we were talking about Beakerhead this morning and all the cool things that uh, you'll be seeing over the next couple days in Calgary. And we're standing uh, in a maze, and these blocks are actually made from basically essentially mushroom, mushroom, hemp, and corn husks. Uh, these blocks are, uh, they're, they're alive, which is kind of cool and a little bit creepy <laughs> so one of that's pretty cool but another cool thing is I want to introduce you to Eden Eden who's a 23 year old Calgarian um, you've been working on a project for a number of years and it's actually on display at Beaker Heads uh, you started this when you were 16 now it's called Sun Saluter maybe explain that to everyone Sun Saluter is a device that optimizes solar panels by rotating them so that they follow the sun. And so we do this by using a mechanical water clock that's gravity powered. And when you do that, you can actually also filter the water at the same time. So our unit provides clean water and energy for people in developing countries. Two in one. Now, I'm trying to think of what I was doing at 16. I was not inventing things like this. So you'd think that most teenagers are hanging out at the mall. They're you know worried about what they're going to do uh, with their friends in the evenings, and you're you're inventing things. I, I mean, I spent a lot of time at Chinook Center too, <laughs> you know. But um, you know, for me, science has been an interest uh, for a, a long time, and for me, I've been tinkering with different things. And I entered the science fair, the Calgary Youth Science Fair every year, and so it's you know been a very natural progression for me. So this isn't just a concept, this is actually being used in countries around the world right now. Yeah, we have uh, units deployed in 16 countries and our headquarters is in Bangalore, India. Wow. Now, there's a charitable aspect as well. Yes, so Sun Saluter itself is a nonprofit organization and what we do is we provide this technology to local entrepreneurs in these developing countries and we provide them with resources, a toolkit, advice and guidance on how they can start a for-profit business around what we do. And so in this way, instead of starting, you know, another Coca-Cola stand or a, you know, cell phone charging station, they can actually start an innovative business that gives them a competitive edge and, you know, that way we can benefit more entrepreneurs and more end users than if we were to just do a business ourselves. I'm, you know what, I've got to say I'm impressed. Not only did you come up with the idea when you're 16, but to have a nonprofit when you could have probably sat back and just watched the money come in. <laughs> I think it's about impact for us and thinking about, you know, Sun Saluter at itself, it will make money, but not that much money, but that not little. That, that little amount of money might make a huge difference for someone else who is really looking to create a new economic opportunity. And in this way, I think, you know, focusing on the impact, focusing on the number of people that we can empower, that is more powerful than just, you know, the little amount of money that might come in from, you know, implementing this technology. Congratulations, Eden. That is amazing. Sun Saluter, just one of the many cool things you can see at Beakerhead over the next couple of days in Calgary.